Hello everyone, my name is Nino Jack Jr. and I'm Emma Karama. Yeah. Um, so we are the team from Magandi Studios to be specific. Why we are here or in the capacity we are in is Agandi Wedding. So we had a shoot in in Jan. Jan. Yep. Um, it was a wedding that we did. It was a wedding that we did for Paul and John. And we are here to take you through, you know what it takes, what we went through, our experiences, up to when we get to the final product, uh, the last product that we have to give to the clients, which is the album. Um, yeah, so, Emma, mm. you are the main photographer of the day. Mm -hmm. um, and I know the preparation didn't start with, you know, the couple seeing you. Yep. yep. Um, on that very day, we first remember you having a conversation with them when they came in for their pre-wedding shoot in the uh, in studio. Yeah. yeah, like, you know, shoot with them, uh, get to know their vibes, get to know their personality so that on the day, you, uh, can you tell us how, how the, the importance of that, of meeting the couple before? Um, yeah. Yeah, thanks. Um, I would give a short answer, it's a very, it's very important. Yeah. <laughs> but to delve more into it, it's like, um, at the end of the day, these are not just clients. Well, they're paying money and all. Mm. <laughs> but um, it's, uh, I would say it's upon us as photographers to, to establish that kind of rapport with the clients. And it's something that is very hard to do on the exact wedding day. Because yeah. for most couples, they'll always be having like a lot of stress, a lot of tension, a lot of thoughts going on. In their mind. Yeah. So it is really so important to meet them at a point where they are, yes, they're still a bit anxious and all, but they're more more in touch with time and everything. Yeah, yeah so for us it happened at a really good time. We had uh, a pre-wedding shoot, it was at studio. And, and lucky enough, uh, they had actually ever come here, I think, for a personal shoot. It was yeah. Mr. Kenya. So it, it really helped. Um, stay smooth and out the entire process. But uh, allow me also give them credit because they are uh, they, they power couple. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you get so you'll it, see it in pictures. Yeah. Definitely. So it really smoothed out the entire process of establishing that. Let me call it friendship. In the on the day when we're shooting, when so we are in the room with the brides and her entire team. We are mm -hmm. not strangers. We are yeah. we are part of them. We are friends. So. Yeah. It is very easy to have to capture their genuine emotions. They yeah. are being real because they know their friends are around. So it, it is so important to establish that. There are many ways of doing it, but I know it can be get a bit have some little tension, say when you're discussing prices. <laughs> yeah. But it it would be the first place to to establish that kind of yeah. relationship, that kind of friendship. That's very good. Yeah. And I remember almost like half of the bridesmaids because in in December or November there was another shoot the yeah. wedding that we had and almost half of them Hello were there. Hello Frisera. Yeah. Um, so when at this wedding it's like they all knew um, half the team that they're working with. Yeah. So I suggest we go straight to the final I've been product. One. <laughs> um, <laughs> haven't looked at it. You haven't looked. We've tried to hide it from you. Man, not easy. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. So this is the final product. Looks good. And first, talk about the front page, or maybe the first image that you see. I've had the privilege of you know seeing some of the pictures. Um, um, I know you shot, but you didn't edit. Yeah. Um, John, 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 John Bukenya. <laughs> Shout out. <laughs> Respect, sir. <laughs> yeah. And just, just a small one. You see, when, when you open up Photoshop, yeah. that those names of credits of people come. Yeah. John Bukenya is also there. Really? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> we shall magnify that uh, opening <laughs> screen. Yeah, so. Look at that. So I want, for me, for me, for this front page, mm -hmm. one of the things that I love about it is actually um, the design of the word, the key symbols, right? Yeah. And I know I've seen it a lot in particular videos yeah. or even in albums where the font used, the text used, just does not match, for example, the colors of the, of the event, 
doesn't match the mood of the event mm. but th everything is just off and, yeah. and i must say even for this wedding that you know the main photographer was emma the one who designed who edited was john the one who laid um the album and did this font is a professional designer Respect alexander sir. Respect <laughs> sir. and and that goes into how a team can yeah. work on a product and everybody is bringing in their best you know talent and at the end of it all something very good is coming out um yeah well i i love it mm. no bet no 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 better way to put it yeah genuine smiles yeah. calmness I, I think one thing i would also credit this couple for is that amid the 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 first person of the of the entire wedding they were able to keep in their element they were able to keep the smiles genuine and not make them look fake to 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 maybe touch on that it it wasn't this is a coangula but it was the first event of the day. Oh. Yeah. Oh, cool. Um, Yo. Yes, sir. <laughs> this is you. This is Emma what? Karama in his <laughs> element. Okay. So, question. Mm. Um, I was there on the yeah. wedding day. I did take some pictures, but mm. I want you to talk about how a couple or even you know the bride or the groom yeah can actually make it so easy for the photographer but also in that they know the camera is watching them or they're about the picture is about to be taken and they're just happy for the day first of all it was so fast paced but yeah. throughout the day you would see pearl was always Ready. in the mood yeah. she was always having vibes she was always smiling mm. can you talk about that well uh simply put i'll just say listen to your photographer I listen to your photographer but then to expound on it more it's i think it's a summation of different men <laughs> i'm <laughs> distracting you it's okay a, it's a summation <laughs> of uh different things in that uh, that entail not just on the wedding day but even like talking to people briefing them that let's not make it look fake in case yeah. you see the camera uh there might be an urge for you to say stop what you're doing and uh, focus on the camera yeah. no you just have to keep reminding them stay in your element you might not because most times we are videographers sometimes we are photographers most times we actually both so they might see like a a videographer recording something and then say they try to change it but then when it's actually what the videographer had gone to record so you just have to keep reminding them yeah these are cameras don't don't have that feeling of say trying to make everything perfect just stay in your element and everyone feels when they say something that is real it it speaks for itself yeah and i believe also someone can see when something is is fake yeah they yeah. can see so I, I think uh, roughly put it would be that just um, trying to have that discussion with someone. Yeah. Give us the vibe, <laughs> reflects in the pictures, and stay in your elements. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to go through the different pages. Mm. Please stop me where you yep, know. Yep, yep, yep. Um, a memory hits you, and yeah. you have to talk about it. Lovely. Always have your girls. Always have people you trust. Yeah. People will pull up, pull up the the vibes on. Mm. Can keep and, going. Um, mm. Mm. Can we talk about the colors of the Kwanjula? Mm. I mean, I'm a photo. Yeah. There was a time when there's when you get to a place and like everything is just in place. And you want to take the credit. But yeah. <laughs> Like, yeah. from the deco person to everything, the designer, yeah. Man, give the credit to the, I don't know if, yeah, did they have a wedding planner? I'm not sure. Or but at least not someone officially, but um, they had, I believe, a team of guys working with them. Yeah. The deco was on point. Yeah. It was beautiful. It was candid. The outfits on point. Everything was coordinated, color coordination. That is yeah. art in itself. 
Yeah. Don't leave. Don't don't expect photographers to bring out. <laughs> 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 Make my pictures look nice. Yeah. No, um, you play a very big role in that. So yeah, you have the freedom in all that. You have uh, you have the liberty in choosing your service providers. Don't settle for always for less always. When you see something you like, go for it. Yeah, because it will all come out to something. It's a lifetime memories, man. I know. People ignore that. Yeah. People ignore that. Yeah. Yeah, but everything was so beautiful. We were blown away by the colors. It was yeah. nicely done. Not so much, not again too little. It matched the people, it matched the vibe. It, mm. was, it was just one of those days where you say this is a good day. Yeah. Mm. And, and it's like, see how to balance your service providers. Don't get a cheaper person to do a very cheap yeah. and not good work for the deco yeah. and then you want to get a very expensive <laughs> photographer. It won't add up. It, yeah. yeah. Uh, those are the colors. You can wow. see the greens, the purples. The beautiful and the ones. <laughs> yeah. A Gandhi wedding. <laughs> <laughs> those are beautiful. To the, to the team behind the cameras. We see you. We see you. John, Josh. It's a lovely... And then the thing I also notice about these pictures is that most of them are candid. Yeah. If you look at say this particular one, there is a look that Paul gives beyond, and you're like, man, these things are nice, eh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They they are really. Yeah. These are dope, man. I don't know if you're able to see it properly on the video. We'll probably pop, pop up something for you to see it but clearly. Some of them, yeah. Yeah, but. Beautiful images. Um, Tradition. Yeah. The modern way. Nice. Mm. Colors. Colors on points. On points. Do we shout out to the decorators and all that? We will, we will, we will. We will. Links down below somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> all right, these are, these are good. These are good. We could talk about the, this is your favorite. It, it, it just hit me straight. It hit you. Yeah. <laughs> um, I remember when we were shooting her um, at this point because mm. um, before the event starts, yeah. you guys asked her to first come to the mm. um, outside. Yeah, outside mm. so that you can get content before she goes back in. And by that time, not all clients, uh, sorry, guests had come. Yep. And she, it's like she put up a show for you guys. Definitely. And like she was listening to everything yeah. you guys were saying. Yeah, yes, 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 yes. Yeah. I think also to add these, because um, most of these angles, well, yes, there was one main photographer, but then remember these things are really fast paced, so you can't really think of all the beautiful angles. So having a set, having different team members on, on, yeah. the, on that set is very important in that the bride. Uh, the 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 that's the more appropriate word a general term the person <laughs> don't mm. want same model uh, on that day might be listening to the to the main photographer but then there is um there's another photographer in what you would call a hidden angle yeah able to capture some of those natural yeah natural reactions and all yeah an example would be i remember there are some shots where i think this was also a, a hidden angle. Yes, even this as well even this yeah. um yeah because this is not a main photographer yeah. angle i would say there are other several ones um and we had two this is a good man <laughs> nice you did well See the colors, the blues, the blending. Alex Love. would tell you about how complementary colors. Um, Land with a gun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm. Beautiful. I remember this guy he was very stylish. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And oh, so this is one of my favorite ones. Yeah. It yeah. was a low angle shot. It was a low angle shot really went down and um yeah i just like how how things just at times 
well, you can take the credit for composition and all, but at times things just work out in your favor. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good day, it's a good day. <laughs> so you just see how like the couple is right in front and right behind them, not in focus, their blood, or like their yeah, support system. Yeah, still vo- visible. Still visible, it's a beautiful shot, I love it. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, they went inside. Very emotional moments, though. Mm. Very emotional. I wasn't inside. You're I think inside. it was you and Josh. I was with Josh. Yeah. Oh, man. Strong attachment. It's, a, it's something so nice to see yeah. that say people aren't just getting married for the sake of getting married. But yeah. there's actually an element of friendship between, say, it's, let me call it extended friendship. Yeah. Say, the man is friends to the parents of the girls and you just see it's not making it friends because they are getting married it's it's something so genuine it's something we saw with john and the pictures can tell it man yeah this is a good one. talk to me about these two shots um from a photographer's perspective yeah the the like you know something is happening where they have to pick the coffee seeds yep. but the fact that you have to shoot it from a um, a raised point of view, mm. um, the essence of making sure you capture something happening, even the little things, rather than getting yeah. a wider shot mm. that would end. Why you hide these details? Yeah, yeah. I think um, most of these things I, they speak more. Mm. Yeah, because I'm picturing if we had the same picture, which I believe we did, if we had the same picture of the um, uh, picking of the coffee beans mm. in white, it might not. Having that picture, well, yes, it's one good thing, but then yeah. having a close-up of this other picture, it adds like what you would, what you would call this, adds to the story, yeah. in that it's, it's really iconic. And for this particular, and it's a tradition, I think, in the, uh, the Uganda. Yeah. Uh, I'm not a Muganda, <laughs> so I can't really explain, but it's something to, I think, to deal with the yeah. bonding of different families, yeah. that kind of thing. Remember, like how we have in our Western, Western weddings, the exchange of rings and yeah. all that. I would, I wouldn't really. I can't stand my ground to say this would be the equivalent of that, but it's part of that. It's more yeah. like it's a cultural, let me call it tradition. Yeah. Yeah. So it's really important. Just like you would be craving to have that shot of the groom putting the ring on the, on the bride. Yeah. These are also very yeah. important, and most times I think we tend to overlook them. Yeah. Yeah. And it's, it's quite. I'm looking at this whole spread and I'm seeing the intention of what Alex was doing. I had right? seen it. You have mentioned it. So, <laughs> it. Bro, so I, hope it, I, I hope he did it intentionally. Most uh, definitely. But I'm sure he did, like having culture, religion, and culture. Culture. Like all of them in the same spread. Right? Uh, nice. <laughs> it's, it's beautiful. Nice so respect, you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he can't see us. He's right there. He's on sound. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this yeah, whole spread is still on yeah. culture. Um, oh, yes, so these pictures. Yeah. So what happened, uh, to give you the story of these pictures, we were, this was a point, she had gone to change and it was a point, it was, I think it was reaching midday, we had gone to get our first meal. <laughs> mm. Yeah, and she was about oh. to come up. Now remember, they had already eaten before, and yeah. then first we had we are not eating in time. Yeah. Yeah. So as we're eating and they're about to come out, someone comes looking for me. Hey, they need these pictures inside. I was like, great, which pictures? What? So I ran and actually find them looking fabulous. Yeah. It was not much to be set up. Just where they were. It was in the sitting room of, of the room where they were going to come out. From. Yeah. One, two quick pauses. And we have... You have it. I don't know if these are among the best ones. <laughs> I, I, would, I, would, I would frame this up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Still more candid. Colors. She's, she has changed, but the colors are still blending still in. Um, beautiful. Mm. This is love, man. <laughs> still tradition. Mm. Whoever laid out, Alex tries to remind <laughs> us not to forget Pearl's vibes and face. Yeah. And how beautiful she was. Look, at, Look at that. Look at this. Beautiful. Damn. From a f- photographer's point of view, mm. you know, um, 
I think these were flowers. Yeah. And it was shooting from through them just to be able to frame the image in that way. I think te technically it, it takes all the, let me call them principles of photography. Yeah. Rules or something of the sort. You see yeah. composition, rule of thirds, you see the focus, you see depth, you see. Yeah. There's some, there's, when you look at a picture and it's just looking so good, just know it takes most of those. Beautiful. I remember yeah. I took this shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and yeah. for me, it looks like it's, you. <laughs> <laughs> and this was a second shooter's point of view, like where she's facing, am I shooting? And me, I'm behind this side. And I'm like, the focus was just, you know, on what oh. what she was wearing behind, but also the, uh, the accessories in the air, in the hair. Beautiful, beautiful. Nice. How do you feel about um, not following a script, shooting what is happening? I think it really helps, um, because I know I was the third photographer. I was doubling between editing the images and also shooting, come to support you and, you and yep. Josh. But it gave me the freedom of Josh and Emma have the front side covered. Can I shoot something else? Remember, I did this shot, yeah. and I remember very well, Iconic. because you guys are shooting yeah. the event. The yeah, you're shooting um, shots like these, yeah. right? Of the the perspective of the guests of from the bride. Mm. Like, you see this shot? Yeah. This can be a second photographer's point of view, even the first. But this, you may not have time to do this if you're yeah. the... Uh, main first post, main yeah. photographer so being able to be that being given the freedom to be creative is actually really nice but yeah spilling some of those images yeah. among a front-facing um, straight-up image I see, yeah. I see. still I think this just summarizes what you're saying yeah so I would never have time to, to do this, this. Yeah. Yeah, but but you'd have time for this, you'd have yeah. time for this. Mm. Um, and I, I remember this guy very well. Mm. So we have these ladies and gentlemen who'd be coming out, but mm. they would have to come out dancing. And I believe this guy did a very yeah. good job to give, um, to kickstart Set them, the start running. So yeah. yeah, if you need help with your event and you need people to bring up the vibe, I would say please get them. Let the MC be the right person. That the people who like if everything is ticked off you'll have a beautiful wedding um, i love this shot yeah <laughs> i loved this shot it's a dope one yeah it is a dope one it's in the element i love that still it takes many of those photography yeah. things it's, um, um, it's a beautiful picture beautiful and for me it reminds me of how she was very vibrant in terms of dancing. Yeah, she had the vibes, man. <laughs> it's like she had selected her songs, and every song that was played, she was, she was dancing to every tune. It's the power of planning. Yeah. You have control of these things. Yeah. Take lead. <laughs> Beautiful. Love the colors of yeah, the Yeah, when girls. they change. Wow, these are beautiful. Yeah. These are beautiful. It's details. Nice. Still respecting culture. Yeah. Mm. Please never miss black and white. Yeah. Why, why don't you think we included more black and white? Because most times it would it be a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's because the colors, the colors yeah. are just so beautiful. Yeah. And um, black and white, I know John selected just a few. Not all of them were put in the album. But I think black, you have to be very selective with where the black and white goes. So black and white can sit on this image you're talking about. So yeah. um, it would sit very well. Um, like this, yeah, you'd see us. Says it all. Yeah. Wow. Beautiful. That's the end of it awesome. all. Yeah. Um, I know one last thing 
we we did at least in how we did uh, the team dynamics of the day in how mm -hmm. you are assigning each creative on each task to do yeah we had um two main photographer you are the main photographer josh was assisting and then you had me who was a third photographer but i was also doubling in a way with john who was editing on the day yeah. um, i know i set the pace for him in like getting the right grade and then he took over for the rest of the day um, yeah how helpful is it on the day because it was a very packed day and I remember we, we didn't realize how heavy it was going to be until we are in the middle of the yeah. day. Yeah, like, wait, the wedding hasn't even started. Yeah, <laughs> and you're feeling yeah. your battery is degraded already. Yeah. <laughs> how helpful is it to be organized on that day as a team? Yeah, there's, um, there's point specialization, mm. I think. I, I think that, that, that in its words should explain itself. Yeah. It doesn't necessarily mean you can't do one specific thing, yeah. but let let uh, split tasks and let to um, know what you are supposed to do and do it exceptionally well, other than trying to do everything. Just yeah. imagine everyone was trying to say shoot and go and edit. It would be confusion all through. Yeah. Yeah. So there, there's power in specialization in that it gives you proper proper channels of of everything let me put it that way yeah it makes the it makes work easier and th that even stretches in say in the delivery bit of it yeah um i can design photo books you can design photo books but we make the designer okay yeah. we're all designers <laughs> but the best designer in town in town <laughs> alexander <laughs> to design the photo book. Yeah, yeah so there is, um, I, I'm trying to remember my small economics. There is, I think, a proper word for that, but it's all about um, someone doing what they're best at. You will always, and working as a team, I mean, you will yeah. always have the best. I know it's very common, more so in Uganda here. I can't, I wouldn't really want to blame, say, the photographers or cause our economy is not the best, yeah. <laughs> but it would be ideal if someone can focus on shooting, someone can focus on editing, if possible, have someone focus on things of like talking to the clients. Yeah. The more we break down this, the more efficient we'll be, the, the better our work will be. It's something hard to quantify, but over time it just shows that you, you, you just can't do everything. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we are talking about editing. Why were we editing on the day? Oh, yeah. So, two things. Yeah. The first is that people are actually living in the moment. Yeah. Uh, it's, uh, I'm not, I'm not really, I can't say, I, I can't express <laughs> this, but it would be something nice for me to, okay. When I think of it more, it doesn't really add up for the couple to have their phones on the wedding. But say for the guests, yeah. if you are you are attending a wedding and you're seeing the pictures being taken and then within a short time you're, you're seeing the pictures on your phone mm -hmm. and with the time and date we are in, people mm -hmm. want to post on status, people want to caption. It's an experience. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's a beautiful experience. Yeah. So why we are doing that is one, to give them the experience but then also, it's, uh, it's something laid out in the different packages we offer. Yeah. Yeah. It's, um, I, d I don't know, what this is going to be cut out, I know. <laughs> <laughs> we won't cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but uh, I'm not sure, but I think it starts in the second package where you, you're able to, to have, to pay for this experience. Let, let me make it make sense. Yeah. The first package you're getting, I wouldn't want to call it bare minimum as it sounds, but you're getting really good work with yeah. the basic. But then it's these small, small things. And when you when you actually get to to think of it like the wedding, yes, it's your day and all, but the people you've invited and much as you're looking forward to having a good day, you want to make it a pleasant experience for yeah. everyone. So that entire creating that entire atmosphere, that entire ambience. We have done it on 
I think all our weddings. Yeah, we've done yeah, it. Yeah, we have done it on all our weddings, and the feedback is always amazing. I think personally, at some point, you can be there shooting, and like your brain, you are tired, and then you just look over to the guest table and you see guys smiling. I'm like, this is yeah, energy yeah, to keep shooting. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So mm-hmm. it's something, something really. How beautiful. how exactly do they get these images? How yeah, uh, we typically share them on a link that is accessible to to everyone mm-hmm. at the venue. I think, of course, they can be forwarded, but we print cards that are placed on each, um, table. each guest table. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And on that card is a QR code that you can scan. It takes you straight to that link yeah. with the pictures. Yeah. And I... Re- I do remember the feedback from all the weddings we've done about how someone can walk up to you and say, you guys do this, you guys are giving us images on the same day, these are beautiful images, and even in the link that they visit, they are actually able to leave comments. And you still keep seeing the feedback, you know, those who are outside Mm. countries who couldn't make it, everybody can actually be able to see the picture, and the experience is always really good. Uh, yeah, please. If you want that experience, it's on our second package. We we'll leave a link yep. here, <laughs> here, right? Right here, here, <laughs> yeah. to 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 see that yeah, experience. So, come to the very end of this review. Um, yep. We shot the the introduction on the same day as the wedding. Uh, maybe we'll do the wedding another time if we get the moment. Um, but yeah, let's come to the end of this video. Thank you for watching. Mm-hmm.